hope you're all having a great start of the day. So I am super excited for today's video because as promised, this is part two of the Valentine's Day outfit ideas. So I saw that you guys liked the last Valentine's Day outfit video and I hope you guys like this one too. Let me know down in the comments section if you want to see more of these types of videos. And don't forget to subscribe down below if you like this video. Give this video a thumbs up and we're just going to get started. For outfit number one, I chose a very floral and colorful look. I chose this red top that is from the Agachi store. Now these flowery pants, you can basically match them with any color that is on the print and they are from Mocha. Now the shoes, I chose the same ones for every outfit except one and I think they are very romantic shoes so I just love how they look on. They are from City Classified. Now I picked this outfit because it has a little bit of pop of color everywhere and I just think it looks very romantic and cute for your date night out or even if you don't have a special someone, you can still dress up that day, it does not matter at all. Now the choker, I'm not sure where I got it from but I just think it makes the outfits look very classy and elegant. Now for this look, if you get a bit cold, because we all know that it's still cold, you can add a little coat on top or a little jacket like I did. And this one is in the color brown and it's from Ashley. For this second look, I went with pastel colors because I just think they make you look sweet and innocent. And it doesn't matter what color it is, I just love pastel colors for Valentine's Day. For the top, I went with this floral pastel pink blouse and you can even wear this with some leggings underneath. Now for the pants, I went with pink pastel colored pants too and these are from Aeropole Style and they are high waisted. I love how these look on and you can wear them with obviously another top on. Now I added the same brown jacket on top, but you can add a little coat on or whatever you want on top just to keep you warm. Now this outfit, I just love, love, love how it looks on and the camera on my phone does not make this outfit any justice. But I think this outfit is very classy and elegant and you can even wear it to your civil wedding. Now this top as you guys can see it has little detail on the front and I think it's very cute and elegant. These bottoms are really dressy. They have a little line going down in the middle of each leg and they are from Space Girls and I just love how they look on. They have no pockets on the back as you guys can see. For this outfit, I kept it kind of office-like, but I just love the little detail on the skirt and the pop-up print on the top. The top has a very florally print and it is see-through, so it adds a little bit of pop to the look if you want to wear it with a bralette underneath. For the bottoms, I just kept it simple with a black plain skirt that has a little ruffle detail on the side and this just adds a little extra bit to the look and puts the whole look together. If you love rompers, then this is the look for you. I think this outfit is very classy. What's up with me saying classy so much? Anyway, we know that black almost looks good every time, so I just chose this black romper because it looks very classy and elegant and it just slims your body too. This romper is from Pookie and Sebastian and I actually got it for $2 in a thrift shop. Oh, 
Now, this is the outfit that I told you guys I switched up the shoes for. And for this outfit, I went with a very sweet but edgy look. And I loved how it turned out. I hope you guys like it too. For the top, I went with this bow accented wine colored top that is from Charlotte Rouge. And it just adds a pop of color to all the black. This florally print skirt is from Forever 21 and I love how it looks on and it's high waisted and very poofy. Let me just say this outfit was one of my favorites from this video and one of my favorite pieces of this video also is this little jacket that is from Ediz Zambrano and I just love that it has the little black accented details because it just adds a little edge to the look. Now for the shoes, I chose black booties because since I'm showing a lot of leg, I didn't want to be showing the whole thing, you know? I didn't want to be looking too naked, so I chose these booties from Olivia Miller. For the final outfit, I went with this very sweet, pastel, classy look. And for this look, since I'm showing a lot of leg, I decided to put a coat on, but you can take it off if you want to also. For the coat, I chose a black one because it's the only one that I have, but you can choose white or whatever color you think that goes with a blue dress. But I think this one goes well with the outfit too. And what I love about it are the sleeves and the buttons on the front. Now this pastel blue dress is from Forever 21 and what I love about it is that it looks kind of Cinderella-ish and also the bow and the belt on the front. Okay you guys, so I really hope you guys like this video. So that was a bit of a workout, mostly if you're a mother. Please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, comment down below which outfit was your favorite, and also subscribe, follow me on my social media, the links will be down below, and I will see you guys next time, bye bye.